well, what inspired me to do this mural was, um, well, first there was a need for it. Um, it was just a blank wall. This is an old Simmons building, I believe. And it was blank and Christy Brown, who works at the Restoring the Pines Theater, um, my friend Reba Joe Goodwin knew me. We go to church together. And she put my name in the hat, I guess, for this operation. And um, we got on the phone and we knew exactly what we wanted. Um, and she provided a list of everything that needs to go in the letters. And I just kind of filled it in um, with different things that represent Silsby. But what truly inspired me was, um, well, first off, I'm extremely gratitude for everybody who helped raise me. I had great teachers and um, great Sunday school teachers. Um, we moved here when I was two because my parents told me that the neighborhood where we lived wasn't very good anymore. And a couple days after we left, there was a drive-by shooting. And so I felt like now that I have a family of my own, I feel like Silsby was a refuge from an angry world. Um, and that means a lot to me, you know. Uh, small towns, everybody comes together, you know. We have brokers, we have banks. We have everything we need to have a nice life. And it's a very sweet town, a lot of people. We have two Tex-Mex foods, <laughs> restaurants, in between railroad tracks. It's a perfect town. Um, and so, so the S, of course, has a train. And I picked a sunset or maybe a sunrise because at the end of the day this town rises and sets on the train. I painted it um, brand new because uh, I liked to think that you're looking in the past. It has no rust on, it's brand new, it's in the prime of its life going to do some work. Um, and of course, Silsby Tigers, we have the eye of the tiger and that song got stuck in my head while I was painting it. <laughs> the Pines Theater, I went there all the time when I was a little girl to watch all the Disney movies. <laughs> um, and it's a beautiful little theater. In the S, there's kayaking or the Village Creek. You know, there's a lot of activities in Village Creek. The Silsby Ice House Museum, which, you know, I'm still working on it. <laughs> the Kirby Mill in the E. A lot of people think it is the paper mill in Evadale, but it was. Um, Silsby was kind of the headquarters for the lumber mill with John Henry Kirby. Um, so you all need to look that up, it's very interesting. But it did burn down in the 30s, I believe. And the other E is the Satsumas. Uh, from what I read about it, a unnamed citizen planted a whole bunch of Satsuma trees and Silsby was nicknamed Satsuma Valley. And it has a lot to do with our culture, um, so anyway, I encourage you to do some research and look up things about your town because I didn't know this stuff until I started painting and I grew up here. So this is what, this is why we're all here is from a long time ago, things happened. <laughs> um, and so I'm incredibly grateful to the people of Silsby um, and the Silsby Chamber of Commerce um, and thank you everybody who's doing donations and tips. Um, also, I just want to say thank you. Thank you, thank you. And for all your Hardin County news, be sure and follow us on Hardin County Live Report.